Good morning, everyone. I've been up since three. You might be thinking she has a baby. Of course, she's gonna be up at all hours of the night, but no, it's not the baby. I was up at 3 a.m. not being able to go back to sleep, watching my angel of a baby sleeping because he is just the best, and I couldn't sleep. And the thing that woke me up was my smoke detector right in the hallway, right outside my bedroom door, it started beeping because it needs a new battery. So going to get that done today. But it woke me up and then I couldn't go back to sleep because, again, not because of the baby, but because I have a business idea. <laughs> at three in the morning, I was dumb and got on my phone, started scrolling through Instagram. And I mean, I always want to start businesses. I always think of like, what are my passions? What are the things that I love? I, I should do something with that. I love, I love making YouTube videos. I miss like doing tutorials and things like that. And I hope to get back to that. I've also wanted to expand even more and create something, make, make a business out of it, do something more than just digital. I want to like give you something. And I think I have an idea. I'm always trying to think of things with Braylee too. So I'm going to run it by Braylee and see what she thinks. Um, anyone else get the best ideas or feel the most motivated when we should actually be sleeping, but we can't fall asleep at night. Like there's no one more motivated than me when I'm laying in my bed and I can't fall asleep. I'm like gonna get up and probably start running. I'm gonna like eat super healthy. I'm gonna like make a plan and get everything organized. And you know, I have all of these intentions and then in the mornings I'm like, Ugh. but it is morning and I've been up since three and I'm feeling so motivated, but I know I'm gonna crush. I'm gonna crush soon. <laughs> I can feel it already, but I am feeling very motivated, so. What should I do with that? Do I stay awake? Do I take a nap? What do I do? I don't know. Right now I'm gonna make breakfast for the kids because they're up now getting ready for school. So I'm gonna take all this energy and motivation and make some eggs. <laughs> and cute braids for Layla today. Got some eggs and baking going on. Are you guys ready for school? Yeah. Yeah. I'm gonna be back with my best friend. Oh yeah, yeah. Cool. Hey, Bestie today in her cute little blue dress, cardigan, sambas, very cute. They're already getting dirty. Winston, I don't know if I've ever seen you wear this outfit before. <laughs> what do you always say? You just look drippy. Just looking drippy all the time. <laughs> you guys are never gonna believe this. Rayleigh's home. <laughs> Have we seen each other every single weekend since you've been gone? Yeah. Every single literally. weekend. Good job for us. I was just thinking it's probably gonna change soon because there was there have been a lot of <laughs> <laughs> a lot of reasons for us to be back and forth. And uh, not forth. really, I don't have a reason this weekend. Well you didn't have to work. I That's a reason. You and you need your nails done. Oh, Winston did not wear those shoes today in the mud. <laughs> Jeez. Wait, no. We can't I have nice things. We'll never have nice things. Wait, yeah, why are there some right there and over there? Oh, are those yours? Are those yours, Bray? No. Okay, we're gonna go get some those Starbucks. Oh, guess who's here? Really hasn't even been hanging out with us for two days. Huh? Or I'm here. I already filmed you were here and I just said Braley hasn't been hanging out with us for two days. I was so excited and One day. guess what? Okay. Wow. Okay. Sad bud. <gasps> no. No, rude. Uh, Why does that actually have come nice? Yeah. You want it. Football's almost over. We were just talking about. Well, I guess it goes through this month, right? Did we figure that out? So we have a few more games. I have like three, four. That's good. All right, Braylee, guess what? what? I'm changing around upstairs. Let's go look at it and see what you think. Before Braylee left, she was packing and I was like, I want to move the office Ow! around and now Braylee won't be here. And I was so sad about it. And now she's here. So she can look at it. I've been working on this for a couple days. I'm so excited to get my space back. You have no idea. It's still a little messy, but. Oh, it looks good. Does that look better over there? Yeah, it looks way better. Also, my office is back. I put these shelves back in here and I don't know if I should have or. Yeah, I like them back in here. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, I'm not gonna like why did why did I buy this? I wonder. For in here. I think I thought I was gonna be like real stylish or something. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't think I'm gonna put it back in there. Yeah. Do you need it? I would love it, but it wouldn't fit anywhere in my room. Okay, I just wondered if you would need it in like your laundry room or something. Mm -hmm. So what I wanna do is get like a cute mirror. 
Anyway, a lot of cleaning to do, but I think I like it. Oh, this is what I was gonna say. Why did I feel like I should make all of these a different pattern? <laughs> I feel like that is making me crazy. So I plan on finding some scrapbooking paper, just like a pretty neutral color and getting all that taken care of. So it's not just like so much. Maybe if I was more organized and not like messy, I could do that, but I just have too much stuff out that it's not gonna work. While I was cleaning up here, I was thinking so many things. I was thinking about how when we moved into the house, like how things were going in. I was thinking about all the different crafts that I've wanted to make and all the different things that I've wanted to do. And I started thinking, what if I did a little DIY craft kit that you could buy? It would just be something like cute and simple that you could do with your <laughs> kids or you could do for a girl's night or something like that. Truly and honestly, I just want to know if it's something that people would like. What do you think, really? What? Like a little DIY kit that I could make and send out? Yeah, like, what, is that something you would order? No, but I'm not crafty. <laughs> That's the thing, like... I want to do something like that. I would love to have like a little business like that, but I just don't know if it's like something that people would do. I'm crafty, so I'm like, yeah, that would be so great. And I know a lot of people who want to be crafty. Before I had a lot of time to do crafts, I always wanted to, but I just didn't have time to like get everything I needed. So I feel I figured that there's people like that also. So let me know. Just something I was thinking about. Also remember how I just made so many random things, these puzzles. I spent so much time on not those ones necessarily but these ones days I would just spend days making these they're so cute it's a little puzzle not only like painting them and putting them together but like creating files and it's just so funny I think Finn has about outgrown that swing <laughs> what do you think he's tired boy all right, really, are we waxing your eyebrows? You know what? You know what I've been thinking about is how like my whole YouTube personality has turned into you. <laughs> You've just been on all my thumbnails, and I'm more all of my a videos. Box more now that I've been <laughs> than I was before. Because I got so behind, and so I haven't really vlogged in between. So every time I vlog, it's when I'm with you, which is kind of funny. Oh, let's see your nails. You did nails. They're like the white aura. You can tell more on the thumbs. Yeah, but they're first. But they're time, so, so cute. They like aren't as. I intense, like that they're like less like noticeable. Cute. Yeah. They're so cute. When you look at the thumbs, you wish that they were more like that though? No. I wish my thumbs were more like the rest of my fingers. Oh, really? We yeah. used eyeshadow. We didn't know. <laughs> yeah. We're learning. Yeah. Does this look like a guy that's ready to go get some diapers from Walmart? Definitely. <laughs> so cute. I've been trying to get him to sleep for an hour. <laughs> He's refusing. He's like, nice try. I'm not laying down. You can't make me. <laughs> <laughs> like I just, got out of, I just got out of there. We just ran into Hobby Lobby and really filled him. And now he's not wanting to get back in. But we have to go get Layla. We gotta go get Layla. We gotta go get Layla. Uh, Braylee got a pink shirt for her uh, Halloween costume. Speaking of Halloween. There wasn't a single Halloween decoration in Hobby Lobby. Like, I'm so confused. Has there ever been? Or do they just do fall? I'm genuinely so confused. I saw a video today that was like, I'm sad for kids now because, you know, we live in a world that's like aesthetically pleasing, like beige. Like everyone's painting beige pumpkins and stuff like that. And they were like, why for Halloween? Like Halloween should be colorful. And when I listened to her, I was like, Halloween should be colorful. And so I was like wanting to find maybe some like gobby, bright Halloween decorations. And there is nothing. That was weird. That was pretty weird. Do you want to show what we got at Ulta? Yes. Starting off with what I got. Starting I'm off trying strong. to be a squ skinny, a squinny legend. <laughs> so I got a body washer. But yeah, I used to use one on my legs before I got pregnant. I probably should have continued using it. I didn't. And then I got the. I also got a face wash a while ago, and then I got this like oil because I've been trying to do it with like a face mister and it hurts. So. Yeah, you don't want it to tug at all. So make sure that that one doesn't tug. And then I got some zip patches. Oh, I should have said I have some. It's okay. I go through them so fast. I always forget about those. I want my mom got. Very exciting. 
she got? Glycolic this. acid. Glycolic acid. For my armpits. For stinky, stinky pits. So they, I, I just saw that you can use it instead of uh, deodorant. It's better for you. Braylee got me this perfume for my so birthday. It's perfume. And I'm Actually, about out. we're not going to show them because we have to keep. keep. No, we don't. <laughs> so. It's our amber perfume. It smells so good. It's just like this nice, fresh, clean smell. It's, it's so $500, so you guys probably don't want it. It's 25% off right now, so <laughs> go get it. it smells so sure good. Yeah. For Malta. Did say that already? Anyway, now we're going to go pick up Layla. Tell me the truth. Did you miss all of us fighting at home? No. Everyone's <laughs> fighting out there. Not fighting, fighting. Just, you know. Just us fighting. And end of the day type stuff. Did you miss the allergies? Mm. Dang. I'm gonna do it. Dry shampoo action here. Then we're gonna wax these brows. If you guys have perioral dermatitis, let me know what you use on your face. Cause look. I'm over. It's been doing so well. It's because it's so dry and I've been wiping my nose. Oh, um, dang it. So it might be all that lotion off. Oh no. Have you tried just like Vaseline? Vaseline's the worst thing you can use on. Oh, it is? Because I used to. Because okay. I used to think it was dry, uh -huh. but you're supposed to be drying it out. Really? Yeah. Mm. I think, I don't know. But I know that, that like, whatever it's in it, it's the worst thing you can use on it. Shoot, that's what I would have done. Yeah. <laughs> you don't have the unibrow. Look at this cutie I picked up to run some errands with today. Also, did we wax eyebrows last night? I don't know. Can did we wax tell? skin off my face? Dang. I don't know. <laughs> I did the thing you're not supposed to do and I waxed it twice. Is the other side okay? Yeah, this side just really hurts. I'm sorry. I did, I'm not supposed to do that. And I, I look that. stupid too. You don't look stupid. You yes, just I look did. like you got your skin waxed off. Eh. Do you think that you'll ever have me wax your eyebrows again? Yeah, I it's free. <laughs> <laughs> I'm coloring some hair today, so I'm getting some hair color, and then Rosie pooped in the house, so I'm gonna go buy some Febreze. One day that dog will be potty trained. Just kidding, she will. Never. Just tied Brayley's hair. Hopefully not too dark. We tried a new color. Um, it's it's Redken, but I normally use Red Redken Shades EQ, but I use a different Redken, a permanent, because the Shades EQ always uh, always yes, fades so fast, so. Here's hoping it's not too dark. Oh, it's pretty dark. I think it's gonna be good though. Yeah. I have high hopes. I have high hopes here. We also did like a warmer tone. I think this is gonna be so pretty. Okay. I'm gonna put it. and just do it. And yeah. I've been doing it since January and I haven't stopped. Yeah, I need to do something. Do I just sit at home if I'm not hanging out with Maddox? Do you like it? Yes. It's very cute. Very demure. Braylee said, does it look pink? I was like, what? It looks like yeah. a little pinky shade. In, it doesn't in at all. Sun. It makes your face look warm yeah. or whatever. It's a really I like pretty. Nice tan, I actually love it. Probably the best out of any hair we've ever done. Truly. Over my red hair. <laughs> That's I so like your pretty. Chain. Thank you. 